Hello, I'm Jim Noble with Noble Smoke, and once again, thank you for picking up your smoked meats from Noble Smoke Barbecue. Uh, today, we're going to talk about the smoked turkey breasts. We do whole turkey breasts, not whole turkeys. Uh, that's the part everybody likes to get. Most of the time, unfortunately, because of the size of the turkeys, usually the turkey breast is overcooked by the time the thighs and legs cook, so these people usually get dry turkey breasts. You can either buy small turkeys to do that or you can come get your turkey breast smoke from us, which is probably my best way to go. This year I'm bringing home a smoked turkey myself. Uh, but I want to tell you how to re-thermalize re this. We will send you the whole breast just like this if that's what you order or whatever size you get. Regardless, whatever, <clears throat> whatever um, portion of turkey breast you get, you can reconstitute it or re thermalize it in a Ziploc bag. You can drop it in, in uh, simmering water and let it slowly come up to temperature or you can wrap it uh, pretty good in airtight with aluminum foil and put it in an oven, maybe 200, 225 until the internal temperature reaches 165, <clears throat> which may take an hour or so. Once you get it and you get it to the right temperature, you can bring it on the table and I'll show you how we cut it. There's a grain that runs from it, and ours always comes with a skin on it, but we'll pull the skin back, and then we'll start cutting the turkey from there. And you can pretty much, if you want to make smaller slices, you can cut it in the middle. You can do like I do. I'll just cut uh, thin or thick slices, whatever your family looks forward to and you just cut it against the grain. Make, there's a grain that runs through it, just like there is in beef. And you'll make sure you don't cut with the grain because it makes it harder to eat. There you go. That's beautiful turkey. Anytime uh, I take turkey home, uh, this particular turkey smoke will sit in the refrigerator and you can slice it as you go or you can pre-slice it. It'll, it'll last you several days. You just need a good loaf of bread from Copan and some Duke's mayonnaise. You got the best turkey sandwich. Or you can put it back in, you can re put it back in dishes. You might want to do it like a turkey pot pie. It's already smoked and flavored. It'd be perfect. You can re make a soup out of it. Or you can do like I do, just keep picking on it all day until it's gone. Thank you guys for coming.